We're broadcasting live from the Dirty South Dome in Atlanta, Georgia, where the living's easy and the sushi is called bait. I thought you said her name was Susie. Uh, but you're right, she did look a little older. Fifteen at least. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Motor City Maniacs battle the Atlanta Vultures. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. Yeah, that's right. What you talking about? It's time to tune in, turn on, and drop what you're doing because NFL Game Day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. So what's the game plan for the home team today, Bricks? Uh, I think they got to keep it simple. A little cough syrup, maybe smoke a little untidy pod pregame so they can keep their heads in the game. I mean, literally. You don't want to get decapitated on the opening kickoff. I say go after the rest early and often. No mercy. He could go all the way. And the defense is on his heels. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The court nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third and two. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it because I'm too fast. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot He just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Man, how did he screw that up? No one died. Bombs don't kill mutants, Grim. Mutants kill mutants. Third and two. First and ten. Oh, man, he really... Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot... 
Nice pass for a 10-yard gain. Uh, it's not a first down in the stat line, but it's a first down in our hearts. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Hey, remember that skeleton lap dance you had at that totally bone strip club last year, Graham? <laughs> yeah, she said for 20 bucks, I'll take it all off. I didn't know she met her head. That was uh, kind of weird. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. Caught for the first down. Hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned MFL rule. They're back up here on first, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down in a mile. defensive play that was bricks kind of like your aunt bertha this guy has some big balls what a hit yeah she does have a big pair grim you're right Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. And it's first and ten. Nice pickup for six yards. Hey man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pilot? Third down and the punter is warming up. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And then catch will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. First and eight to go. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my... The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. Second and three. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders 
Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. She goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Ball man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Hot, hot one, hot two. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a run. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. First and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Second down in a lot. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. He refuses to go down. First and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. 
Hey, kids, do you remember getting shoved in a locker because you wore glasses? Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two. Oh, my gosh! The defensive player looks like he's lost his mind! Now that's just the berserker rage kicking in. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got dead mutant bingo! All I need is 77 to bite it! First and ten. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. If he had getting killed... <laughs> First and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Two minutes remain in the half. Great! I'm gonna take a dump! Again? You just wet. How is that even possible? Ah, it's the nachos, man! Want some? Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot... Hot eight. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. Uh, hot two, hot That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is... At some point, they're going to need to put this ref out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hint. Dirty tricks attack the ref. <laughs> and this is a first and... And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. forever. Hot, hot one, hot. Uh, come on, man. You got to catch that. I don't catch anything, Grim. I'm retired. Second down and ain't going to happen, partner. One, hot. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. 
The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Briggs' mad stopsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. Boom! There go. Smart move there as they call a timeout trying to get the ball back for another shot. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch. And he, and he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. And that was a game-breaking punt return for a touchdown. Man, that play just changed the entire momentum of this game. What a run. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. A nice run there for eight yards. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Pressure right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. The idea is to kill the defensive player, not your own guy. That receiver has to move away from the ball marker. Second down and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. First down. And it's first and ten.
No little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. He picks up ten yards on that play. Second down in inches. And he just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback's going to be hurting. Or dead. Or worse. Third down and long. off to the races the 30 and he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive and it's first and ten and he picks up eight yards on a strong run second down and two First down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pen. If you get one more bullshit penalty, you get one more for free. You'll also probably lose the game. Just do the attack ref dirty trick. They're back up here on first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. It appears that the last ref was calling his stockbroker during the huddle, and that tipped him off. It looks like he won't be buying that boat anytime soon, huh? First down in a mile. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Great chance for a big game. But still not enough for a first. Even I'm frustrated. And I'm a team that For a kick this far, you just got to kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim. It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good. Huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there.
Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Hot three. You know, a lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the ground crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Three. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. He picks up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better watch out because if he gets... And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 90.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? The 20. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a saw butt praying on this asshole. And this werewolf is from London, I believe, signed in the offseason. Yeah. His hair was perfect. Better watch out. He'll rip your lungs out, Bricks. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all you can eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Second down and seven. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Sound of bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when you're not young. And it's first and ten. It's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Yeah, yeah, 
<laughs> Third down, and the punter is warming up. Picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. showing, but their team has a chance to respond. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? The defense gives up five yards on that pass play. Second down and five. That's a pass and catch for no gain. Then how is it a pass? Third down and five. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Well, that play didn't work. We'll have to rethink that. Second down and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Oh, boy, they're going for it. This could get uglier than the baby resulting from an orcish family reunion. Oh, what the brutal hit! First and ten. Two minutes left in the game. Thank God, I gotta take a wicked dump. Feel like I'm sitting on a wax candle. Not a nice shoulder, you know. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. You've got to catch that. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And it's first and ten. In a fight between King Kong and Godzilla, the player on Roid Rage, he dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. He had it for a second there. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Greedy or desperate? 
desperate. Either way, they're going for two. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Side kicks the desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal possession. Stealing ain't right, Glenn. It just ain't right. And it's first and ten. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're gonna dump his ass. A timeout is called by the defense to stop the clock. They have one remaining. Second down and more than the QB would like. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Oh, he almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big port of John in here. We're a freaking fracking accident waiting to happen. The defense takes its final timeout. They can't stop the clock anymore, so they'll need to stop the offense. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Glenn, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they? And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. First and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. For pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. And he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Well, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Bricks. <laughs> the Vultures limp away defeated. Yeah, they look so sad, Grim. I kind of feel sorry for them. They participation award. Screw those losers. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Well, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotrophism. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right.